Breaking news, three people are shot in western North Carolina, and now tonight we're hearing from the family of one of the victims. The NC County Sheriff's Office has confirmed the suspect in the shooting, Lucas Murphy, is now in custody. He was hurt when exchanging gunfire with deputies and taken to the hospital for treatment. Now, deputies say it happened in the Murphy area of Yancey County. We mapped it all out for you here tonight. This is just northeast of Asheville. And while this investigation continues, we're hearing more about this terrifying encounter. Fox Carolina's Kennedy Harris has been in Yancey County all afternoon and has more. And there's still a lot of questions about what exactly led to this shooting. I spoke with the father of one of the crew workers and he says he's still in disbelief. Here's what we know. The sheriff's office tells us a resident of the Murphy Town community, suspect Lucas Murphy, confronted contract workers with a tree service company. At the time, the service crews were on a site clearing right of way for a power company. Investigators say during the confrontation, Murphy shot three of the crew workers. All three victims were taken to the hospital with serious injuries. Also, when deputies arrived, there was more gunfire as they attempted to arrest Murphy, leading deputies to fire their weapons, and Murphy was then injured and taken to the hospital. Chad Triplett is the father of one of the crew workers. His 24 year old son called him after the shooting to tell him what happened. Triplett says he's grateful the Lord watched over his son and he wasn't one of the ones who got shot and he's praying for his co-workers who did. Fear overcomes you at first and when you realize that when I realize he's okay then you know there's a sigh of relief but then I'm worried about his co-workers um, and then anger sets in that um, somebody would do something so terrible uh, to people just doing their job, you know, just pad people that don't need to be let back out after they've hurt people. The sheriff's office also tells us Murphy has faced charges in the past. In 2019, he was charged with felony assault with a deadly weapon with intent to kill. Going forward, the Yancey County Sheriff's Office and the North Carolina Bureau of Investigation will be handling the case. From Yancey, Kennedy Harris, Fox Carolina News. Now